everybody, it's Ashley with GarmentPrinterInc.com and today we're going to be showing you how to do direct-to-film printing on your Ricoh RI-1000 or your Ricoh RI-2000. You will need to make sure you have the following supplies on hand and that your ColorGate software and printer firmware are updated with the most recent release. To start, load your image into ColorGate and choose Colored Garment. Next, choose Advanced Settings and on the Print Mode tab where it says Layers, select from the drop down menu C to W or Color to White. Make sure under Special Colors for White that Brightness is selected from the drop down and the minimum is set to 20. Then set the choke to negative 5. On the Color Correction tab, select White. Click the square in the top right corner of the graph and change the output to 75%. Then click OK. Make sure your image is mirrored, and then output it for the rip. You can now recall the file on the printer and prepare to print. Place the DTF film on the center of the platen and secure both sides with a piece of clear tape. Be sure that the tape lays flat and does not cause the film to bulge up. Once secured, simply adjust your platen height and you're ready to print. This is a good time to prepare a workspace, such as a table with your tray for applying the TPU powder to the print. When printing is complete, remove the tape and carry the printed film to your tray. Be sure to wear gloves while handling the TPU powder. Apply a modest amount of TPU powder and roll it over the entire print, allowing the excess to fall into the tray for reuse. The powder will adhere anywhere there is ink, giving the image of a frosted appearance. You can hold the print over a garbage can and flick the back of the film to knock off any excess TPU powder on or around the print. At this point, the print must be cured. This can be done in a desktop film curing oven by hovering your heat press or with a conveyor dryer. Refer to the instructions for the powder you are using in order to determine the appropriate time and temperature required to melt the TPU layer. Properly cured, TPU will have an orange peel texture and a glossy appearance. Your print is now ready to apply to your shirt. Align your image on your shirt, cover it with a sheet of craft paper, and press at 325 degrees for 15 seconds on medium pressure. Remove the shirt from the press and allow the print to cool completely before peeling. The last step is to cover the image with a sheet of craft paper and repress for 5 seconds. This will ensure your print adheres well with the garment as well as giving it a much nicer hand feel. Thank you so much for watching and hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions or comments, you can reach out to us via email or our support line.